Okay, uh, so we have Miguel, our handsome hero, who I think crosses in a little closer to charity. Our tragic heroine, our heroine who's been sentenced to burn at the stake. You reach out to comfort her, and you look into her frightened eyes. Oh. What are you doing? Watching you, sister dear. You should see the expression on your face. You can take a flying... Uh-uh. There's no swearing in a pageant, Kay. Especially one about pilgrims. But I don't blame you. <laughs> because someday, Charity's gonna get her memory back, and then... He'll never get Miguel. Okay, so when he's um, touching you and comforting you, Miguel's reached out to you and he's comforting you. And uh, TC, he can be seen, right? Yeah, but you know what? This light right here might cast a shadow on his face. I'll fix that. Well, that's no problem. We can fix that after rehearsal. Yeah, keep going, honey. Okay. Let's see. Um, where am I? Oh! <laughs> okay. I'm really feeling kind of hot, Miguel. Maybe you need a drink, like a soda. I think I saw a machine in the lobby. I'll come with you, Miguel. Uh, you too, Jessica. That way we can bring enough for everyone. Look me in the eye and tell me you had nothing to do with that fire. Are you nuts? I had nothing to do with it. I don't want Charity dead. I just don't want her to remember her past. I need time to make Miguel fall in love with me. 